Our expectations as the Malawi is that uh, by the end of the uh, workshop, uh, we have shared uh, a lot of experiences and, uh, and the knowledge as well as practices amongst the member states that are here. And uh, using these uh, uh, exchanges, uh, we can improve uh, the way we prepare for uh, humanitarian logistics. Fundamentally, it is the nerve center for all the logistics and supply chain that we have when we are dealing with emergencies. So uh, it is important that we have it uh, being led at a national level as it then have a mirror image of all the other regions in the country. We would overcome that by presenting the concept make people understand what's the difference with what we are already doing in the country and what is meant by logistics preparedness and response because if we are logistically prepared it would help us to be able to minimize the time that we take before we respond when an emergency comes we are better prepared in knowing what do we have who do we have and which tools we can use so we are more efficient and faster responding. The Community Solutions Workstream, we have worked in different tools. One of those is the LogAE, the Logistic Information Exchange Platform, where before a response happens, or even during a response, we already exchange information with partners. We have a tool where we can easily share information and we have a tool where we can exchange data, not only as a data stream, but also in a platform where you can see, we have an easy way that partners can see what is going on in terms of physical accessibility, in terms of warehouse mapping, in terms of realizing what is going on, how they can respond faster and more efficient during a response. Prepositioning is, uh, is an important uh, mechanism because it's the first line of response after a disaster um, and also because it gives enough time, uh, if it's done properly, to um, allow the next uh, round of supplies to come uh, while still providing support to the population. Environmental sustainability and humanitarian logistics is a cross-cutting issue. If we look at the cycle of uh, supply chain planning and implementation and delivery of services to the people in need, really if preparedness uh, goes hand in hand with environmental sustainability. During the procurement and planning phase, you can look at the infrastructures that you have available in your warehouses, your fleets, uh, and look at the procurement of core relief items and the packaging of those core relief items to make them a little bit more environmentally sustainable to have a large impact on the reduction of uh, negative consequences of our operations.